Hello and welcome back everyone to another tutorial on Tableau. This series of videos will help you take your skills from beginner to expert level in Tableau. Do not forget to hit the red subscribe button and the bell icon so that you are the first one to know whenever I upload any new video. In today's session we will see how to create a lollipop chart in Tableau. Let me first show you the demo of what we will be doing today. Here I have a bar chart that shows percentage scored by 10 students in a class. This is a simple bar chart that you already know how to create in Tableau. But what different I have done in this bar chart is that instead of showing labels on the top of each of the bar, here I have added labels inside these circles to make the chart look like a lollipop chart. If you want something different from a regular bar chart, then you can make use of this lollipop chart. Now let's jump to Tableau and see how to create a view similar to this one. For this tutorial, I am using the student's performance dataset. In this dataset, I have marks of 10 students in 5 different subjects and the final percentage that the student has scored. So the columns that are present in the data set are name of the student, then the gender of the student, then marks scored by the student in five different subjects, maths, English, science, social studies, and French, then the total marks and the percentage that they have scored. Using this data set, we need to find out who has scored the highest percentage. So we will use a lollipop chart to display the percentage of all the 10 students. Now let's go to sheet 1. First, we will create a bar chart to show percentage scored by 10 students of a class. So drag name column to the column shelf and drag percentage column to row shelf. Change the fit to entire view. Turn on the labels by clicking on show marks label button. Let's hide this field label, right click and click on hide field label for columns. Let's change the default format of this percentage column in terms of percentage. So go to percentage, click on the drop down. Here go to default properties, number format. Click on percentage, we don't want to show any decimal places and click on OK. Now we can see the labels in terms of percentage. So this is a simple bar chart that shows percentage scored by 10 students of a class. Now to create a lollipop chart, we will convert this chart into a dual axis chart. Press control on the keyboard and drag this percentage column next to the already present percentage field. Let's change this chart to a dual axis chart. Click on the drop down, click on dual axis. Let's synchronize both the axis. Right click and click on synchronize axis. Now we will select the mark type as bar for the first percentage field and let's select circle as the mark type for second percentage field. Now let's decrease the size of bar to make it look like a lollipop chart. And now let's increase the size of the circles. Now we want to show the labels inside these circles. So first of all, let's turn off these labels. Click on this hide mark label. Now make sure this circle mark type is selected. Go to label and click on show mark label. We want these mark labels to come in the center. So go to alignment and select middle. Let's hide the axis, right click and uncheck show header. 
now you can edit the color of these bars and circles as per your requirement let me select light gray color for these bars so make sure bar is selected go to color and from here let's select this light gray color this one looks good and let's also give a border select this black border lastly let's hide these grid lines right click click on format then go to borders select none for the row divider and select none for the column divider now go to lines then go to rows select none for the grid lines and also select none for the zero lines so here you will notice that the black border is not clearly visible here so we need to edit the axis let's bring back the axis right click and click on show header now right click click on edit axis from here select fixed let's decrease the value let me add here 0.01 and keep this as automatic close this edit axis window now you will observe that the borders are clearly visible let's remove these axis right click and uncheck show header lastly if you want to give different colors to these circles based on some condition say we want to show the students who have scored less than 70 percent with red circles so we will create a calculated field just close this format lines window click on the drop down click on create calculated field let's name it color and the formula will be if percentage is greater than 0 0.7 then good else bad and so here we are telling tableau to categorize the students who have scored percentage greater than 70 as good and the students with the percentage less than 70 will be categorized as bad make sure to give the percentage in terms of decimal otherwise the calculation will give us error click on ok now select this second percentage field and drag this color field to color now let's edit the color double click on bad we want to give red color to the students who have scored less than 70 percent and let's give green color to the students who have scored percentage greater than 70 percent so now you will see that all the students with percentage less than 70 are highlighted with red color and the students with percentage greater than 70 are highlighted with green color you can give the condition here according to your requirement and then select colors as per your need in this way you can add some modifications to the regular bar chart and create a lollipop chart this was all that i had to cover in this session i have added the link of this workbook in the description below do not forget to click on the subscribe button and the bell icon if you do not want to miss such useful content in the future thanks for watching this video see you in the next tutorial